So what is good, YouTube? It's your boy Legendary EA, and we're back here for another. Yo, I, I don't actually, actually, I don't think I've done one of these scenario videos in a really, really, really long time. But yo, we'll, we'll be testing out if Team LeBron can win an NBA championship. Now, I think now I personally think that they can, especially since they're going up against the rest of this league. But I had to test this out because this is just more than seeing if they can just win a championship. Let's see if they can go 82 and 0. Yeah, let's just test out how many wins they can actually get. And a championship, you know, 2K sometimes holds me and I don't win it. But anyways, if you guys want to see more of these types of scenarios, make sure you go ahead and drop a like on this video. Please hit the subscribe button and join the family and comment down below which scenario we should be doing next. And before I even get this thing started, yo, prayers up for DeMarcus Cousins, man. Man, like... I saw that play last night, and now this man has a torn Achilles and is out for the rest of the season. So I'm pretty sure that in his place, it's probably gonna be Paul George. Yeah, I'm 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 sure it's probably gonna be Paul George or somebody in the front court. And I am and I am almost certain that Chris Stops will will probably take his spot in the starting lineup. So you'll spam up prayers for Boogie with the prayer hands in the comment section below because man shouts out to him but other than that this is the line that the starting lineup is Kyrie Irving LeBron said that Kevin Durant is going to be playing shooting guard a seven foot shooting guard of course LeBron's playing small forward Anthony Davis and for the sake of this video DeMarcus Cousins is still here you know off the bench Russell Westbrook Victor Oladipo Chris Stops, John Wall LaMarcus Aldridge Kevin Love Bradley Beal this team should be a, this team should be able to win a championship theoretically, but you know how 2K does this. And then, oh yeah, here are the settings. Uh, teammate chemistry is turned off, trades are turned off. We just trying to see this thing through. But yeah, man, I, I just think I just think it's crazy how Demarcus got hurt a day after he was named to LeBron's team. Yo, let me know how you guys are thinking about LeBron versus Steph as far as their teams go. Right now, we are six and zero. Oh. What? Less than 14 players. Are you kidding me? All right. Let's just sign two scrubs who, who are never going to play. I, I think the general consensus is that LeBron's team is way better than Steph's. Yes. Yes, Steph has James Harden. Uh, who else? This man, this, man, this, man, this man has Clay, Draymond. But, yo, Braun walked away with a hell of a great team. And if DeMarcus wasn't hurt, I think that LeBron's team would uh would have smacked them around. Now, now Steph did say that his team has shooting, but I mean, bruh, I don't know. You literally let LeBron get Westbrook, get Durant, get Boogie, get Davis, get, get, get almost everybody. And yes, you got Giannis and Harden, but is that really good enough though? Let me know y'all's take on that in the comment section in the comment section below right now. Whoa, hold on. I, I have to address this. We, we went 18 and 0 and lost to the freaking Hornets. This is this is what I, I was talking about. Sometimes this makes no sense at all. But we're just gonna keep this thing pushing. I like doing these types of videos like this. And like I said before, if you guys want to see another one of them, yo, let me know in the comment section below. And yo, leave me some suggestions because we might be testing out if Team LeBron can beat Team Steph in a seven game series as far as 2K goes. So let me know about that in the comment section below. Right now we are 26 and one. If we lose another game, I think that we have a serious problem with this game. Like, <laughs> but yo, other than that, man, like, like, like us before, let me know what you guys think about um, that whole DeMarcus Cousins situation and what are the Pelicans gonna do now? Because uh, Boogie, this was a contract year for him. I think that he's almost a lot to like resign with them now because they were just starting to like click we lost to the freaking bulls oh my gosh wow wow okay makes no sense but i guess let's just keep this thing pushing but yo uh yeah like he's clearly gonna resign um but this sucks like as soon as things are starting to work out we lost to the bulls again but let's just ignore that uh i, I just don't know about the future of the pelicans I, I i really don't if you guys have any kind of insight on it let me know in the comment section below and i will respond to y'all's comments but currently the squad is 48 and 3 
We lose to the Jazz. Yo, these losses are, are making no sense at all. I'm not going to stop simming. We're going to let this thing play through. But, yo, who's y'all's MVP so far in this season? Like, at first, of course, Giannis had it for, like, the first week. Then James Harden took it over. Then he got hurt. Uh, and then people were saying, Braun, Braun's team, team is losing. Who's y'all's MVP? Of course, I'm kind of a biased Rockets fan, so I'm still rocking with James Harden as we lose two games in a row. Uh, I'm still going to be rocking with Harden. But I think that Chris Paul should legitimately be in the, in the conversation. I'm not saying that he should win. I still think I'm still rooting for like James Harden, but I still think that he should definitely be in contention. Um, and then as far as the All Star stuffs, as far as the All Star snubs goes, uh, with Chris Paul, Paul George, uh, Drummond, De Devin Booker, was he really a snub? Like I was watching TNT and. I think Paul Pierce said the first smart thing there he's ever said, which is your team only has like 17 wins. That's why, especially in like the Western Conference, Paul George, you can say he was a snub, but all the people there deserve it over him. Uh, Kyle Lowry probably should not have been an all-star in the Eastern Conference, but Al Horford, he's actually doing decent for like the Boston Celtics. But, yo, see, the season's over, so I can stop talking about random stuff. Steph Curry wins MVP. Yeah, 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 this doesn't apply to us. Of course, our, our coach is coach. Yeah, as it goes 75-7, and seven, we should have went 82-0. and 0 Because, no, like, we, we were beating the hell out of the Warriors. We lost, we lost to the Bulls twice, the Hornets, the Kings, some, some, a bunch of trash teams. All right, did anybody from our squad make it? Team LeBron, of, of course. LeBron makes it. Uh, anybody else? Anybody else? We get nobody else. Uh, but we finished, of course, first team. Let's see. We finished 24 games ahead of the Raptors. And as far as the stats go, these were our stats. Durant led us in scoring with 17 points a game, five boards, five assists. LeBron with nine assists, six rebounds, 17 points. Here you go. If you guys want to go ahead and pause it. So, yo, can we can we can we win the chip though? Can we win the chip? Or before that, any All Stars? We had Durant and LeBron. Those were our only two All-Stars. Yeah. But can we go ahead and win this ship? Round one versus Brooklyn is, is in the is in the playoffs. All right. That's cute. Because they, they go ahead and they get swept. Can LeBron sweep the Celtics without Kyrie? Should be able to. But they actually take one game up against the Bucks. Let's get them up out of here. They get swept too. And we're taking on Golden State. Now, Golden State obviously does not have Durant. But they still got Steph. They still got Steph, Clay, and Draymond. So Steph still has part of Team Steph on his squad. Now they should get beat. We take game one. We take game two. Bruh. Stop. Are you kidding me? Wow. This is really about to happen. <laughs> Yo, this is this is really about to happen, huh? Yo, this is wild. Yo, this is wild. <laughs> oh my gosh. So even with a team like like this, Braun, Durant, Davis, Kyrie, Russell Westbrook, and all that, the Warriors still win the championship, and they don't even have Kevin Durant. I've never seen that before, but that is why we test these things out. Now, obviously, th th this has nothing to do with me, so don't blame me for this. Blame 2K Sim. Blame Steph Curry, blame whoever, blame somebody else, man. But other than that, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you go ahead and like it up and hit that subscribe button. I'm still kind of sick, so hopefully my voice didn't annoy you guys this entire video. But this was our final roster. It was Team Braun. It was LeBron, Durant, Anthony Davis, Kyrie Irving, Russell Westbrook, DeMarcus Cousins, John Wall, LaMarcus Aldridge, Victor Oladipo, Chris Dops, Kevin Love, Bradley Beal, and these guys who never even touched the floor. So... With all these, with all these superstars here, LeBron still can't beat the Warriors. That's wild, bro. That's actually pretty crazy. But yo, let me know who we should be doing this with next. Like, like I said before, make sure you go ahead, like, comment, and hit the subscribe button if you guys are brand new. And yo, like I said before, who has the better team, Team LeBron or Team Steph? I guess, I guess we will find out if we do that other 2K experiment but i'll see you guys in the next one make sure you go ahead and follow me on twitter at legendary ea and i'll see you guys later peace y'all
Opposite times, promise shit is getting out of line like when you make a stencil. Or getting out of line like when you break a pencil. Violating the treaty of a side.